five days. That was all. One nil. Finished one nil to Newcastle. Really shocking, shocking performance and a really bad result. Beginning of the season, we need to be picking up these points to, and to put in a display like that. So disappointing. Really disappointing. We got it wrong badly today. And what was wrong though? Like I couldn't see anything was wrong. Like Newcastle set up really well. They played their game. But we can't just. Why can't we break these teams down? I think I we got the lineup wrong. I think we, we looked completely toothless before Ericsson came on, and then even when Ericsson came on, we still couldn't do anything. I think with say like Stone Warders, so they still had eight players at the back. They got that goal. Yeah, but players eight of our players. quality you've got to be breaking these teams down. I think no. we gave them a one 0 lead. The, the goal we conceded was absolutely shocking. Sanchez and Rose again not concentrating. Sanchez falling was getting pushed off that ball. Too he easy. really, really he did really annoy me today, and. I think uh, playing Son and Lucas, two players who like to play into space, who like using their pace, weren't able to use it today. And they, I think he got that wrong. Starting Ericsson on the bench, I think he's trying to prove a point that, you know, if Ericsson does lead, that we can cope. But it didn't really but prove that point. we can't cope because we've, we've, seen, we've seen it against Aston Villa. Now we've seen it against Newcastle. He had more passes when he came on than, than uh, like, the rest of the team. anybody yeah. else in the whole place. I can't see where the creativity comes from in this team when Ericsson's not on the pitch. Yeah, we did struggle badly. We struggled badly. Newcastle looking dangerous on the break as well. And it's, it's something we really got to figure out because the Arsenal next week doesn't get much bigger. I know it's going to be a different game, but if we don't sort ourselves out... I'm not looking forward to that game, man. You know, they, they, it's a, look, we, we haven't had... We this haven't, game has taken everything out of me. And the I'll past, go fucking North London derby The past week. three games of the season, we haven't played well at all, to be honest. We got a lucky draw against City, yeah. and we were 1-0 down for large periods against Villa for... Uh, coming back to win, we I think we missed in Dombele as well, big time. Yeah, well, in we the did. game, we did. I think and so. I think so, so when he came on, it really was quite good. Lo Celso, yeah, you liked him. Yeah, you know, I didn't even go much in the game. I didn't. I, I didn't really see Lo Celso much. It's, it's I thought pass. it's fast, and he's got that smooth running, just like uh, Lamella. I don't think you should have taken Lamella off. I think you should have taken Winks off. I, yeah, I, you know what I did? I did Carl well, Walker Peters out injured now, looks like a hamstring. One thing I did that like the look of was uh, Sissoko at right back. I think he did a good job there. I like yeah, the look of him know. there. He looks good there, but is he going to play a whole season there or anything? Carl Walker Peters went off injured, that's a two, three weeks out. Oh, I don't know why. It, look, it looked like a hamstring. We'll see, I will see. It looked like it, he was holding it. Yeah, I guess we'll see how bad it is, but um, I think Sissoko looked good at right back, which we're going to need him there if Foyf's not out for a while and Carl Walker Peters and Wayne Just Aurier. Look, this is a big blow for us, this game. We're losing 1-0 yeah, to Newcastle. Right. We can't really afford to be losing At these games. As well. Really poor performance. Well, we go into the North London derby. Hopefully we can change our fortunes in that game. But it's hard to put your finger on what went so wrong this game. I think... And I thought Harry Winks as well. Team. Another poor performance from him. You've yeah. got to shape up. Winks, really. got to shape Winks up for the North London Sanchez. derby. Winks, Winks and Sanchez. Sanchez were awful today. It's about time the Iron gets back in the team. And this could have been, this could be Ericsson's last game for Spurs. Hopefully not. Wow. If the transfer window will be closed, I think by the, by the time we play Arsenal. Yeah. So if, if Ericsson goes, yeah, I mean, we're not. If we don't have Ericsson, we'll have no creativity for this whole season. Other than Deli Ali, yeah, we got Deli to come back. That's they, true. They need to play together. And we got no Celso to bet in. So but it just shows lost. when teams come here and put eleven men behind the ball. What can we do with Lucas and Son? Well, I think we're, I think the big part for me is just giving a 1-0 head start. I think if we, we go into the second half when them only holding on to a 0-0, maybe we can get a goal. But then having holding on to a 1-0 lead makes a massive difference. And it was shocking. Really bad goal to give away again. And this time we couldn't make it pay. Look, we got to get our heads up because we got Arsenal next. So yeah. uh, let's do this. All right. Come on, you Spurs.